So the, today we're going to be dissecting the fetal pig, and the first thing that we have to do is we need to put it into our dissecting tray in a position that exposes the uh, underbelly or the abdominal and the thoracic cavity so we can take a look at the uh, internal organs. So the first thing I'm going to do is um, start with the hind legs. I'm going to tie a piece of string around the back leg. Not super tight, and it doesn't have to be super tight. I'll double knot it just to make sure that it stays on. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to wrap that around the underneath portion of the dissecting tray. And then I will take my string and wrap it around and tie it around the other leg. Now you want to sort of tie it so that the legs are spread open so that you can access the middle of it. So the legs are not in the way. All right, then we're going to move to the front portion. Do the same exact thing, tie it around the front leg. Again, I just like to double knot it just to make sure that the string doesn't slip off. We'll bring that underneath again. If you tie it tight enough, the pig should, sh should just sort of sit on its back without having much trouble. There we go. So sometimes when you are tying your pig up, sometimes it gets really loose when you tie it around, and sometimes your pig's fall to the side. So one trick that you can do is you take a piece of tape, and over here on the side, you can just pull it down tight, take your piece of tape, and tape it on the side. It just makes it a little bit tighter so that your, your, your legs of your pig are, are open.